When I was a young child, uh, my family uh, used to travel the Caribbean for the holidays, uh, that being the Christmas holidays and the Easter holidays. And we used to travel with a group of friends, our friends as well as their friends. And we wanted a community type of a feeling like we had at those times when I was younger. When we came to Anguilla, we found an island that represented that kind of feeling. Uh, good beaches, good family, uh, where a place uh, where people could get together and enjoy uh, the holidays as a group. Uh, and this was the exact place we found back when I was a child. We developed our property and the landscaping to match uh, the National Park, which is next door. The National Park is a green, lush parcel of property that currently has underground caves. Uh, those caves will be open to the public, and we hope that our property will become part of that property when you're walking down the beach and you're able to see both properties together. We developed the units to be in a, uh, a family-type setting whereby we have enough bedrooms for, uh, for larger families as well as small families. But the way the units and the buildings are separated on the property, we wanted a community feeling so that people would come live here, know their neighbors, bring friends, return every year to have the same relationships and the same friends that are here. Uh, so community was a number one um, uh, consideration that we did when we designed the property. When we started looking for the correct operator for this development, we went looking for the best possible boutique operator that we could find. My family and I spent approximately a year interviewing different boutique managers throughout the United States and came across Trust Hospitality uh, as being the type of boutique manager we wanted. Boutique management is Trust's specialty and we were very happy to select them. It's not easy working with your family. Um, as part of this development, my wife and I are leading up the charge, but of course our sons are helping us, Joshua and Zachary, in the development of the property. And of course, my 83-year-old father is uh, heading, up, heading up the charge, if you know what I mean. Uh, Dad has been developing property in the United States for over 55 years. Uh, we have built hundreds of condominiums, cooperatives, rental developments. We own uh, over 200, 300,000 square foot of shopping centers, as well as some major office complexes in Bridgeport and in New York uh, and uh, in the suburbs of New York. This development has been an unusual development for us. We have built other hotels, but coming to Anguilla uh, has been a family project and we've enjoyed every bit of it. Susan and I have traveled all around the world and we've visited the best possible places you can be, the best islands, the best beaches. When we came to Anguilla, it was a breathtaking, unforgettable site, and we knew that's where we wanted to build this development. This is an island hideaway and a paradise unlike anything you'd ever want to see. Coming over the ridge uh, down to our development, seeing the breaking of this, uh, the waves, the turquoise ocean, it is paradise and breathtaking. Mm -hmm.